It's time now for the latest in local sports and sports district recreation swim meet taking place today down in Camden County. The Prawn is expected to do well. Have a lot of swimmers qualify today for the state swim meet. And that event takes place today down in Camden County. Eight Wayne County Recreation All-Star teams competed for state championships over the weekend and last week. And of the eight teams, three bring home state titles and three others finished state runner-up. So six of the eight teams finished first or second. We have some of those state champions in studio tomorrow here on the World Famous Butch and Bob Show. As the 8U boys, 12U girls, and the 14U boys all bring home state championship trophies. Meanwhile, the 10U boys, the 14U girls, and the 10U girls finished state runner-up. 14U boys were in Augusta. They finished Saturday with a two-inning game over line 17 zip to win the state title. Coached by Rob Royal and Hunter Robertson. Team members include Tate Altman, Rowan Blanton, Luke Carter, Jeb Craven, Aaron and Joshua Eby, Eli Grantham, Will Green, Cade Lynn, Nick Thomas, Maddox Wilkerson, and Deacon Yeomans. Again, they are state champions. Our congratulations to them. Also state champions, the 12 and under girls, coached by Ron Sluter. Team members, Morgan Boatwright, Chaylin Gillian, Ellie Grace Harrison, Kendall Horn, Jaden McCann, Kinsley McCants, Hardy Purcell, Emmy, La- Emmy Lace Richardson, Kelly Scott, Ada Sluter, who pitched two no-hitters in the event, Addison Thompson and Marley Walling, and the 12-year girls state champions. Our congratulations to them. And the 8U boys team coached by Dominic Scapino, team members Landa Case Beasley, Cooper Bettner, Palmer Browning, Axton Dumas, Axton Connard, Tyler Reed Manning, Trip Phillips, Court Perkle, Dominic Gray Scapino, Jonathan Logan Scott, Hagen Strickland, and Case Tyre. They're AU state champions. Again, our congrats to all the all-star teams. Great summer entertainment. Congrats again to Rec Director Lamar Eccles and his staff. Again, have some of those state champions in studio tomorrow morning to talk about their state championship run. Atlanta Braves begin a three-game set tonight or tomorrow night with the New York Mets. They have the day off. Ronald Acuna hit his 21st home run of the season. The Braves beat the Reds 4-zip on Sunday. Can they have the day off? They'll host the Mets for a three-game set beginning tomorrow night. Braves with the chance to make up some ground on the first-place match as the Braves remain in third place in the division, five games out of first place, five games back. Washington in second place, they're four games up, and Phillies are five games up, basically tied for the Braves for that third-place spot. Again, the Miami Marlins are nine games up. Braves and Mets for three games beginning tomorrow night. All the games right here on Big Dog Country, FM 105.5. Atlanta Hawks lost at home to Milwaukee in the playoffs. Final score, 113-102. They now trailed the best of seven series, two games to one. Game four Tuesday night, also back in Atlanta. In the College Baseball World Series out in Omaha, Nebraska, down to the final two teams, both from the SEC as Vanderbilt and Mississippi State battled out best two out of three beginning tonight. Vandy looking for their third title, second in a row. Mississippi State looking for its first ever title. in first game tonight on ESPN from Omaha, Nebraska, Vandy, and Mississippi State. That's going to do it for the latest in local sports.